The NAMS Bison 2022 study is the second national study of bison NAMS has conducted. The first was conducted in 2014. The Bison 2022 study will build upon the 2014 baseline information by collecting trend information and also seeking information on new topic areas important to producers. The, that data are now uh, outdated and it needs to be updated. We need to have a better understanding of ourselves right now. The snapshot, uh, like a Polaroid, begins to fade. So we need to have a better, uh, more up-to-date version of this. We will conduct Bison 2022 in collaboration with the National Agricultural Statistics Service, or NAS, from July through November 2022. We will partner with NAS on Bison 2022 to ensure representative sampling and analysis and confidentiality for participants. All U.S. bison producers and stewards will be able to participate in the study. Uh, being that 2014 was the first NOMS study that we had on bison, it was enormously helpful. So just based on that study alone, we know that this data benefits our, our business at large. The hope is, is that we can get above that curve so that we have a, a very solid foundation in the scientific understanding of these issues so that proper management uh, can follow that. To make it easy to complete the questionnaire, we are offering three options, a paper-based survey you could mail in, a web-based version you could complete online, and a NASA-assisted telephone survey. We're also excited to offer free biological testing as part of the study and as a thank you for completing the questionnaire. Biologic testing results will provide new information about gastrointestinal parasites and enteric microbes in herds, as well as information about pasture forage nutritional value. Producers will learn about the parasite levels in their bison and whether parasites are becoming resistant to dewormers. This testing will not only help producers directly improve the health of their bison, but will also help them develop long-term strategies to reduce parasite problems. The forage analysis will help us better understand the nutritional supplementation needs for grazing bison and will help producers identify supplementation that might be needed over winter. And don't worry, we want this to be easy for you, so all samples will be collected from the ground and will be shipped in prepaid shipping kits. We will provide further information about sample collection, including an instructional video in the kits. You know, we're still just trying to understand why are bison more prone to certain parasites than, you know, other species of livestock. If you want to know more about the industry and kind of see what a lot of the trends are industry-wide, it has to be captured in some type of data, right? There's no way to analyze it year over year if you know, we don't input that data. So I know that the survey takes a little bit of time, but I think it's well worth the effort. We need this information so that we can put it together on an aggregate level, still maintaining the business confidentiality that people have, but yet provide the, the information that can help us prioritize herd health issues or management or you know, resource conservation. What are our priorities as, as an industry? Again, we have very limited resources, so knowing where those priorities are at is, is critical for us best using the, the resources that we have. We don't have a lot of information for bison producers. This information is vitally needed. We hope to hear from you. Thank you so much.